and what's happening guys it is day two of the venom $2,650 buy-in. Let's fucking do it. So uh, I think we're going to have like 220 bigs. We're going to be about 40 off the money. Let's just see how we get on. So 395 remaining. We have 38 off the money. A min cash is 2.3k. We already have $10,000. One in bounties, chaps. Okay, this guy's short-ish with the 2.5k bounty, which is pretty juiced. So. Okay, villain defends. We see an absolutely woeful board for our hand. I think I'm going to see that. Just I'm not really too bothered about realizing with this hand. Get called, we will shut down on the turn and hope to river, I don't know, a pair or something. Uh, how about the Jacko of Hearts, maybe? Queen of Diamonds, I'm probably going to bluff this one versus check. Try and fold out some 4x, maybe some 6x and stuff. In terms of size, I still think we're going to have some strong hands. I think something like this is pretty good. And we get snapped off by King Queen. What a fucking Grim River, man. I'm not going to bluff on... Uh, I guess I bluff on a spade, but he probably probably bets on a spade. What a fucking horrible river that was. Good start. Right, it's playable hand here in the Venom. So this guy, low stakes player, is just obviously going to just try and min cash. So if he raises, he's just going to have aces. Like, obviously, just tanking 14 off the money. Basically, I'll, I should raise any hijack because we're getting folds from the big blinds. Basically, always, so... Uh, yeah, even though he's big stack, we are still going to be three bet in this hand. Colin's fine as well. Uh, yeah, we're deep, so we'll go nine. 10, 8, 3, not the flop we were looking for. Uh, I am going to see bet this hand. I think I'm going to go half part. We've got some good turns we can barrel on, and we should be able to get folds from like fives and stuff with no club. I'm going to size up a tiny bit, actually. I think this is good. We block some of his like strongest. Uh, I guess even blocking queens is something good. It's really not a good card for my range. Even though it's really good for our, like, it gives us a, a decent draw now. What do I really get to fold out now on turn? I guess something like Ace-8 of spades. Is he really calling that pre? That seems kind of fishy. I'm unsure of what this guy's about. I think check him back, but then I don't really want to bluff a lot of rivers against him. Because I don't think he's going to believe bet check bet. So, unfortunately, I'm going to check this one back. Maybe we should just barrel the turn if I'm not willing to barrel river. I don't see us getting that much to fold here. Maybe like sevens with a club, if that even calls the flop, which it might not. I think as well, at this point, people just go into check call mode, even with their stronger hands on boards like this. So, like, ace 10 plus. It's just never going to fold. Jacks, yeah, makes sense. Jack on the river would have been fun. Oh, yeah, ace king. <gasps> Come on. Come on, Molecula. You're in the money now, buddy. You're in the money now. Ah, womp womp. Um, do I ever want to call and see if this guy wants to squeeze and allow this guy in? With the 16% three bet, I don't think it's too unreasonable. He'll be playing out of position as well in a three bet part. So I think when he's got a big bounty, I think Colin seems okay. Obviously, we'll see a turn. In fact, a lot of the time we're going to be seeing a river here and we'll be checked. Depending on turn, but we'll be calling flop and a lot of break turn. I guess I'm blocking everything and still two overs. Unblock both the draws here. Uh, goes check, check. I think I should be able to value bet this, but I don't think enough people actually call. Guy goes for the over bet, and I think I'm going to call. I block ace four suited, which is pretty nice. And what do I think he's got for value? I guess maybe like jacks for value. I think um, he'll just have some like his bluffs. It'll be things like jack, uh, like jack 10 of hearts and stuff like that. I think calling this is fine, uh, especially with the Ace of Hearts. I think the Ace of Hearts is a really good card to have. I don't expect to see many 4x other than that because 4-5 is just going to barrel turn. So I think this is a pretty reasonable hand to call turn with. And Queens, yeah. So maybe I should fold because he plays lower stakes. He probably doesn't bluff. We lost a minimum there, Ace King versus Queens. I mean, yeah, we can fold River, but he, he's not really repping a lot apart from Jackson Queens specifically, I guess. So. Right, we open 7-8 suited in the Venom. We got a 10-8-6. I would be betting this heads up, I think, and bet calling against Big Blind. Yeah, I think I just want to check back and realize. Uh, 10 trips. Yeah, I was going to say expect Big Blind to do a lot of betting. How about a 7 on the River? I don't think I'm going to have much raises on this board, so... Nasty, to be honest. Wondering what I'm going to do versus check, to be honest. Do I still want a value bet? Yes. But it's not guaranteed we have the best hand here. I'm not folding against this guy versus Shove, I don't think, either. When he checks. I guess he he can actually have a, a, a better hand. I'm not even sure if I should value bet that. It just felt really nitty to check. King Jack in the Venom. Defendable hand, depending on what happens. Yeah, we'll still just be calling here rather than squeezing. I think squeezing just... I'd rather squeeze like Jack-9 suited. Just more playable hands, I think. I think it just makes sense as a call three-way. 
Hello, I am thinking of a turn card dealer. A bit annoying now because when he does bat, if we call, we can get check raised and not really get to see a turn. Do I want to barrel the turn is the question. I think so because I think this hand has some pretty good just... Like we block some hands that continue and then we can represent a lot on the river on certain rivers, right? We can have like Queen Jack, so a nine, we can barrel. Um, we can barrel a diamond blocking some flushes. So I think it's a fun one to bluff even three way. We river a straight. You can definitely have flushes here, like Asex of diamonds. Brings in some two pairs. I guess just do this and be in a world of hurt when he raises. I guess he could raise king queen with a diamond. There's this size in as well. I guess I call because I can chop, but I expect to lose to Asex of diamonds here. I think the only flushes he has is like ace five, ace four, ace six, ace seven. I guess we just call. Maybe he is bluffing for this size, but this just feels like a flush. I don't think I can fold though. He should go bigger as well, which is dumb, but. Yeah, King-9 as well. That's such a fucking disgusting river, man. It really is. That's such a fucking snide river. Just one out of... What else am I going to lose money on? There is no card I'm going to be able... That I could ever in a million years back call. So fucking nasty. Getting one out... Getting one outed in the biggest online tournament I've, I've ever played. Seems fair. Seems fucking fair. Fucking fish sizing as well. Really fish sizing. Picking up the jacks in the Venom. Daniel Ma with the raid. Is it going to be raid run good? Is it going to be raid run good? Um, so if villain three bets, which they don't, it's going to get awkward because I think I kind of have to peel. We're going to check back and call turn versus a big bet and then be faced with an annoying decision on river and probably end up folding this hand. I feel as though he's going to do a lot of over betting. Okay, half bet's really nice because we beat value here. And the king should slow him down sometimes with some hands. Even queen X. No. Sweet. Uh, two thin to value bet. So we have to check back beat the ace five. Oh, something to note though what have i got in bounties 10 plus 2.8 yeah so this is officially my biggest ever cash online in the venom well i want it to be a lot bigger than what it currently is so we're gonna try do we cover anyone here no we cover the big blind uh, the small blind somehow fold around to him obviously not this guy's getting well out of line by the way i think he's a fish he, he called three four suited before i'm gonna have a flop deal Ugh. do i want to check raise probably just check raise with the diamond right check check Thank you very much. Worst turn in the deck. We'll check call turn and then check fold river. Do I, do I even need to call turn? Yeah, because I, I think he'll fire out some like queen jack off and stuff. Maybe he just bats those on flop though. Nah, we can still improve as well. So I think we want to we wanna call one. Nice. Now we just don't win. Can I hero though is the question. I mean, I just don't need to call this, right? I can just have sevens with a diamond and then call that. So. Just because he's obviously not betting ace now. Yeah. Ace 10 suited. Uh, yeah, we're going to 3 bet, I think. Very playable hand. Um, I wish there was a club here, man. I think just very side check fold, to be honest. Maybe call versus small sizes, but then I'm dead sometimes. Yeah. Really, such a shame, man. Not got anything going in this. Dribbled down from 5.2. Lost almost every single fucking hand. Yeah, we'll open here. Not really super in love with it, but we cover the big blind, which is good. I guess, yeah, I, I forget that my bounty is so big, which is why these guys are calling pretty wide. I've got a huge bounty. That's why he's calling 3-4 suited and stuff. Completely forgot about it. I don't think I, I would have played hands any different anyway, just maybe being a bit... Playing hands that play better post. Sounds about right. I guess I'll just wait for aces, man. Nice, we get a pay jump though at least. I mean, it, uh, what, what's going to happen a lot is it's going to go open and then shove and then... Like, can I reshove this? Oh my god. Because I cover him as well. What about these guys? I think I'm going to go for this because it's a 2.5k bounty. And even when these guys call, we're still going to have reasonable equity. So we're going to go with this. Oh, nice. That's lovely. Another fold would be amazing. Somehow a queen. It's for 2.5k. Fuck, I've got two out. Queen of hearts. Oh, uh, yeah. All right, at least we didn't get, uh, at least we didn't bust. Question is, I think if it folds round, we can just call this. He's opening super wide under the gun. I mean, we could probably just shove, right? Because, yeah, we're going to go multi-way here or that. Okay, well, if he's got a better hand, it's GG's. These two should never have a better hand, though, which is good.
It's a really good card because there's some hands that he turns that have a flush draw. So I'm probably going to bet bigger than I usually would. No, I think half part's fine. Good luck, us. Yes! Fucking go. Moan it in. Up to 70 bigs. So you're saying there's a chance. <gasps> Shit, ace queen. Oh my god, fold shove. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We'll be four bet shoving this though, so. Against a lot of opponents here. Be four bet shoving against Shays or Sick. Ooh, this one's really interesting. Do I still shove anyway? The 2k bounty, I do want to call. He doesn't seem that aggressive post. Here we get called by like 10s, 9s, stuff like that, do we? Or do I just want to call here? I think call might be best. Okay. And then maybe check raise. Oh, big bet. Call and check and check jam safe turns. Oh, wow. Don't know if it's a thing, but I don't give a fuck. I'm leading turn and then shoving river. 100% of rivers, I think. Tanja could suck. I don't think you should have eight, so yeah. Yeah, shove in. Wanna fade the snap. Fucking come on! Oh my god, that's massive. That is extremely large. What is that board? That is naughty. That is naughty, that turn card. Naughty. Nah, I'm not having that. That's naughty. Oh my god, that is naughty. Alright, this guy's been three bet me a lot. I think probably just call rather than four bet. Because I don't think four bet is going to get through. It's too good to fold, right? Even out of position. How about spade, spade, spade? Okay, we got a pair. It's hard to make a pair, boys. Okay, it goes half bot. About the five of diamonds, dealer. Oh my god. Oh my god. How am I doing this every time? How do I just call? these cards in all right i don't think i'm going to play raises on this turn so i'm going to call i don't want to see a club but i'm not going to fold on any river uh something like ace three would be disgusting he's still going to shove like jack's plus here for value so snap check boom oh ace king with a club i mean if it's a club i w I, I probably double up nice seven million as many as seven. Honestly, this we live in a simulation here. Uh, right, I don't think I can do anything versus shove here. Okay, I'm still going to open now that we've got a bit more chips though. Yeah, I'll battle with you now, boys. I've got big boy stacks. I've got my big boy pants on. Who fucking wants it? We've got pocket fucking kings in the Venom. Oh, he covers us still. <gasps> pay and cry. Oh my God, pay and cry. Pay and cry, go all in. Okay, Thompson might be all in here. No, he's not. Uh, yeah, we're still going to just three bet, right? Calls, which I expect a lot, and um, we get a pretty shitty board. I think we just mainly flat all of our pairs when we don't cover here. So like we don't, I don't think we really have sets because if I covered, I would three bet these hands, but because I don't, I wouldn't. So uh, definitely a board we check back on uh, and then check back turn if we get the opportunity, which I don't expect we will a lot. Yeah, we'll see a river and then make a decision. And this is a really, really shoddy river as well. Having a king of spades sucks. I guess he might check some 10 jack now, though. Um, so he's going to call super wide, but then that even includes like 3-4 suited and shit. Does he call like ace jack or suit and then just barrel here? So because I'm going to check basically range on flop, what better hands do I have? Do I have 10s? Yes. Do I have 9s? Maybe. I have some flushes for fucking sure. I think this, if we had, the, again, if we had the other combo of kings, if we had the king of diamonds and the king of hearts, I think I'd call it. I don't want the king of spades, and I do want the king of diamonds. And it might seem like a really innocuous thing. It might seem like a small thing, but it makes a big difference. When we have, when we don't have the king of spades, he has like king, queen, king, jack, king, deuce of spades. He will have those hands that might want to bluff. And when, um, when we have the king of diamonds, we block king, queen, king, jack, king, ten, king, deuce of diamonds as flushes, which he will have. So, yeah, I think um, I think it's fine to fold there. Really dumb, though. Oh, we've got King Jack offsuit here. This is a hand we doubled up with last time. Yeah, she does have a bigger bracelet, to be fair. But I got a bigger trophy. Should have whip it out. Yeah, I guess we'll call here and then be in some uncomfortable spots. That's something really shitty, like three big blinds, so we can have worse Jack X that wants to check back forever. Okay, nice. Really like uh, to see check. And then I guess we do something like this. This is the worst hand I'm ever going to bet for value. He's going to have queens sometimes, but and kings, but we block kings, which is nice. 
And I guess you could have like Ace Deuce and stuff. Take it. Like over seven milli, boys. Why do I keep getting King Jack off as well? What are you doing? Open jamming 27 big blinds. And am I calling? Yes, I think I am. This is for 1.4k. Do I think he shoves Ace King and stuff? Possibly, but he shouldn't. I think he might shove Ace Queen, maybe Ace 10, but then he's going to have like sevens, eights, nines, stuff like that. Maybe like fives and stuff. So, and we can afford to take the hit here. Okay. Oh my God, hold. And we will absolutely moan it in. No ace, no 10, no nine. Oh my God. That's how you absolutely moan it in. That's how you moan it in. <laughs> you lose a flip in the 215 and then you win a flip in the 2650 for a 1.4K bounty. I think there's a term for this. I think they call it. Oh my God, picking up the fucking aces. We cover both these dudes. Open it up. Uh, what kind of size do I want to go? Something like this. How polar am I here? Not that polar. 11 seems fine. Oh my god. So this is a spot I would normally always flat, but I don't think they're going to have that many bluffs. I mean, they would do. I still think I'm going to shove. Or do I want to call? All right, high roll, we're going to shove. I really don't think they're going to have that many bluffs. Okay, hold. Hold. Oh my god, that's fuck. Oh my god, that's so big. That's actually just, that's actually just too big. That's actually just too big. That's actually just too big. It's, ac it's actually too big. I don't think I can deal with it. Gonna make a hell of a YouTube video, boys. <laughs> Let's fucking go. 14 million chips. An unfathomable amount locked up in bounties. For the boys. Can I call Jack 7 suited here? Can I 3 bet Jack 7 suited? Yeah, we'll get we'll we'll get we'll get a bit out of line here. We'll get a bit out of line. He's been three xing when he's been opener. Faulted three back quite quite a lot. He doesn't have that much incentive to call out of position. Um, what do I want to do on this board? I'm gonna do this. I think we have. Met, did we fold out some better hands? Maybe just eights and nines. But also, if we do like turn a seven or something, I want the pot to be to be bigger. Buy once, cry once. Um, check turn, and then I don't really like having a jack for hero calling river. Maybe I could just like absolutely blast this one off. Oh my god, that's a seven on the river. I can't, I can't. Can I, like, I don't know, I don't think he calls with a worse hand if I shove. I think shoving's too much, but then the bounty, like, can he have like six, seven, seven, eight? Oh my god, it'll be a lot if he, if he has a better hand. What's he gonna have that's better though? Tens? He's never going to have kings. A7 suited, but... Yeah, I'm going to shove, but it might be thin. I don't know if it calls worse. Have 7-6 somehow. Can only have 10s that beats us, right? All right, we take the pot. Ooh, 16 million. God, I wish I had a bit less. That feels a bit... Eh. But I don't want to raise when he has a 6.5k bounty in case he has 7-8 suited. Is that in third, boys? Is that in third in the Venom? We live in a simulation, don't we? Clearly. Obviously. Is it now, Bean? Yeah, biggest online score by a long way. And it's not over yet, guys. We're sat in third. Oh, my God. We're far off another jump. Yeah, fuck it. I'm just going to open 8-6 suited. I think you're a big man, dear. I mean, I'm calling this, right? 5.7k bounty. A hand that's not going to be dominated in terms of he's not going to have many 8x or 6x. Might have some. Okay, we'll see a turn. Oh, my God. Can I call in a turn again? I'm kind of, I'm kind of scared to do it because of how insane i've been but i'm thinking of a turn card and i think you boys and girls know what the turn card is that i'm going to be thinking of oh, it was red <laughs> it was red i think i probably call turn with this hand as well i unblock all the obvious draws and we have like outs to improve against basically everything do i ever like donk shove on um certain rivers though Queen's really bad as well. Ace Queen would take this line and then check a lot. I feel as though I need a. Do I need some kind of diamond or do I want to check shove this? I mean, what really bet folds? There's not really a lot that bet folds that isn't that we don't have. Like, what wants to reopen the action here? Like Ace King. What's that size about. Oh shit! I've got no fucking time bank. Shit! Come on, ACR. Give me some more time bank. Are you mad? Got four seconds in a 2.6k buy-in. Hello. Jesus Christ. That goes my erection. Picking up the aces, man. As many as aces. Guy's got a 4.2k bounty as well. Oh my god. Uh, I can just go like this size, right? 
Go on, son. Going to be three bet on your wide. I actually think it's, it's unfair that I have aces. I shouldn't be allowed to have aces when I have this many chips. Stick it in. Oh my god. Hold, baby. Hold. Three. It's so weird not calling for a seven. Oh my god, chat. It's just so many. It's so many monies in bounties. I shouldn't be allowed to have aces there. It's actually not fair. Oh my god, I've got 19 million chips. I've got 19 million chips. So many chips, man. So many chips. Oh my god. I mean, this isn't going to fold to me, is it? I really wanted to make a joke and slide the slider up, but I can't even make the joke. Okay, we've got a pair. We'll be seeing a turn for this price. If we were heads up, I could consider leading, but three way I can't. And then we just fold turn. I think he'll battle his Queen X a lot as well, because even protecting here when he's got a big bounty, like, isn't the end of the world, as well as value. It's kind of hard for us to have the best hand anyway. Especially on this river. Do I want to bluff? Do I ever get like 10x or like like jacks or something to fold here? Oh, my fucking time bank, man. So I think I can probably bluff because I can still win his bounty because I have a pair. So I can turn this into a bluff and try and get two people to fold wrapping queen x or a flush. Because I don't think I have enough showdown here. But I do against um, a four big blind all in. Maybe check raise now because he's, he's only going to have like... Like he's, I mean, yeah, definitely not against that size. He might be doing the same thing though. This kind of feels like a could be like a seven X bluff here, or like sixes, or just a flush. <laughs> he's got the nut flush. He wasn't folding at least. What's the point in overbetting that? That's super weird. Like, why would you overbet? Like, what are you trying to do? Picking up the queens and the big blind is short as well. Oh my god, we get to flat here versus Reyes as a trap. Yeah. Shove. <clears throat> Call's fine. Uh, gonna be betting. We will stack off against big blind here. Gonna go for a really big bet on the turn. There's a lot of rivers that we don't want to see. I don't think he's gonna have that much value here. Like, uh, sorry, that, that many hands better than ours. And I still think a load pays. And then if I go this size on the turn, I'm gonna check a lot of rivers versus call. I'm gonna check like a stay in here. Am I? It feels so neat to check, but I'm doing it. Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't really think he'd have that much value, just given that he wants to just try and get money in. Yeah, it's a flop that's not going to be good for him, but he's going to want to just like, there's going to be a lot of hands that he can just get in on that flop when he's got like sub 20. At least we uh, check by the river. Oh, that's annoying. Pocket tens. Oh, big blind shot again. I mean, we're less happy here about flatting but we still want to trap because we're not getting 200 bigs in here like if he shoves and he reshoves then we just fold it i mean what do we do versus shove and then like click do we like call just fold rico okay let's go flipping low cards dealer let's fucking go Let's go. That's another 2.6k in bounties. And back up to 18 milli. Woo! Opening king seven suited. Go on. Go on, son. Ah. I don't really want the big blind to do it because big blind seems to be a lot tighter. Small blind can three bet, to be honest. We'll call in position. Yeah, I think we can call this in position. They've got a $7,000 bounty. This hand can hit nutted hands. Take a flop. Ugh. Really not the flop we want to see. No three bet part. You got the page up though. Are they going to see bet range for this size? If, I mean, did they ever have that ace queen for this size? Folding feels too nitty, but I honestly think we could fold flop. Oh my God, I might have to fucking blast this one off. Oh my God, I might have to blast this one off. Kind of don't want to though. Guess I've got some low diamonds, but other than that, I've just got a load of two pairs here in straights. He's going to have some jack X, but... I think ace jack is the most likely. It's hard to block that. I guess maybe we could turn ace queen into a bluff here. Uh, I don't really have showdown. That's a problem. Now, do I want a king? I want to... Uh, I mean, blocking kings is nice. Queens is a more likely hand, though. Ah, uh, why is it the nine of fucking diamonds, man? 
I really don't know what to do on this river. I really don't know what his range or my range looks like, so I'm just going to give up now. I don't think we have a win or chop, so... It's fucking yes. Really shit river, because I think I think we get it through on bricks, man. I think we get it, get it through on bricks. I should fold the flop, though. I should fold the flop. I should I should fold the flop, though. I really should. So missed up on the flop, but what a, sh what a sick river. Do I get it through? Like, does he fold on other... I have so many jack X, man. King jack, queen jack, ace jack, ten jack, jacks. Jack nine suited, jack eight suited. Jack seven suited. Oh, man, that would have been a fucking... Imagine just hit bricks and I just gangster bluff him off queens. I should fold flop, though. I should fold flop. That's a fucking missed up. What a shit river, man. Let me fucking... Let me dust it. Let me bl let me bluff top... Let me turn top pair into a bluff. The reason why is well doing it, because nobody nobody turns their one pairs into bluffs, really. No one's sick enough to do it, but I am. I would have loved to have just blasted off there. So glad I checked, though. Queens makes a lot of sense. <gasps> Picking up the queens. We've got a good hand. Do we cover anybody? How the fuck do we cover nobody? Oh, no, we cover him. Well, he's not folding any two cards. I know that much. Yeah, I'll size up a bit when we're under the gun. Would he have seven deuce off is the question. I mean, how anticlimactic was that? Queens, yes, finally got a hand. Yeah, raise, bet, fold. Oh, my God. <laughs> Picking up the aces. Holy shit. Oh, what do you mean everyone folding? Okay, it's going to go limp call a lot. Um, I guess I will flat versus three, but... <laughs> Or can I just, like, click versus 3-bet? Okay, we don't get to find out. Didn't really want to see this. 10 jacks possible. Um, we'll see a turn for sure. It shouldn't really have king-queen. Obviously, we've got other sets. It's going to play a lot of calls here. Wow, this is really nasty. What am I doing on river if I call the turn, though? Uh, I might end up folding river. We'll see. I guess a deuce is a good river. If he has 10 jack, he has 10 jack. Does he still shove, like, queen nine here? Uh, I think, like, all the, like, jack X of clubs, I don't think the ace of clubs is, like, the biggest, the best blocker here. Is he really doing this with, like, 10-9? Jack nine? I guess so. But then jack six of clubs, jack seven of clubs, ten, like, ten four of clubs, stuff like that. I think fold and then call, like, I don't think the ace of clubs is that useful of a blocker here. Is he really just gonna just do this with, like, jack six of, like, hearts and stuff? Sigh. Wait all that time for aces and then lose. So fucking nasty, man. I don't think I can do anything. I don't, I don't think I ever want to check that flop. Just because I have huge advantage. So fucking sigh, man. I really want to make day three as well. Like, I, don't, I don't give a shit about the money. I really want to make day three. Uh, easiest spot. Uh, still two off the jump, right? So no points. Making this a few big blinds less. Okay. I really wasn't expecting fold. <laughs> like, I was just so sure we're just all in and getting called. Okay. So it's a double gutter, not the one we were after. Straight. And just call it really. And then if we get jammed on by a big blind, be like, what do you mean? Nice. I actually expected him to barrel his like nonsense like that on the turn pretty often, which is why I actually checked the turn because I wanted to realize. Nice river. Back up to nearly 10 milli, boys. Let's do it. Picking up the kings. I'm going to say I would be flatting. Bang it in. Uh, against that size, I think I'm just going to shove. Don't think I really want to click here, so. Take it down, that's fine. 15 milli. Back up to 15 milli. Let's go. Yeah, we're going to open fours here, especially with this guy here. Yeah. Shove and everyone else fold somehow. Oh, that would have been juice. All right, we cover some people as well now. We've got chances for bounties. Not the flop I was after. Ugh. I might go get a massage tomorrow. And get her caught in a massage if I've got time. Checks around. And, and this is the problem as well when I'm super tired. Like, trying to work out what two opponents' ranges look like on this board when I have fought. Like, I think this is probably an okay hand to bat the turn with. 
maybe not because like yeah it's just trying to figure all that out and on this tide it's just really awkward i think this is a reasonable bluff candidate heads up for sure three way it's just awkward it's like okay what like part of this does he have do i ever want to check raise blah 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 it gets real real awkward no i don't think i want to bluff river mm, a measly bit of showdown we don't beat too much here we beat some hands he could have ace queen he could have like five six hundred seven six hundred we're gonna see like sixes and stuff though sometimes what are you really wrapping here? King, queen? And king's hand specifically? Would they not bet flop? You really betting queen jack here? I mean, what are we going to see? Like ace 10, ace 5 of spades maybe? Yeah, I don't think he has enough of value here. I don't think he bets like 7s or 10 jack. Ah, fucking mate. I'm so tired. I think I was. I think I meant to call and I clicked fold. Uh, mate, honestly. I, I think it's close either way. I think it's close either way, but I literally me meant to fucking call. Be nice to take that 8k bounty, eh? 20? 20, you're saying there's a chance this should never fold around to me. Small blinds should either just call or shove basically any two cards. If it does fold around to me, I'm fucking... You, you better bet your bottom dollar I'm clicking the call button. If he calls, we can't overcall. If he shoves, we fold. Just I need to make sure I click the fold button if he, if he does anything. Which I'm assuming he's going to. $9,000 and he's got so many big blinds. Oh my god, I have to call this. This is for fucking 9k. Jesus Christ, what do you mean, fold? 10. 10. Take a 9. Oh, 10 or a queen. Queen or a 10. What do you mean, fold illusory? What are you folding there? Literally. 2-3 off? Even then, you can make an argument for calling. $9,000. And it's less than a tenth of your stack. You fucking stain. Jesus Christ, you just made me lose 12 big blinds, you pillock. I mean, it was a nice, easy spot for us, at least. Uh, this guy is a fun player. I'm going to give him the tight, the knit tag. I mean, maybe not in this spot. I, like, I should probably 3-bet call this, but I'm not going to. I should probably cold 4-bet shove this versus raise 3-bet, and I'm not going to. I mean, I have to raise this, right? Versus limp. I'm happy with you raising so I can flat. Okay, we, t we, we take this. Let me flop king, king, king. <laughs> or let it just be a, a complete brick. Oh, God damn it. Just Let me just get to show. I just want to go to bed, boys. I'm scared. Good news is I can take my time in this hand. Oh, I can't take my time that much because I guess delay, but... I am going to check back. Which I actually think is fine as well because we don't have a lot to protect from. We allow potential bluffs. But also we allow a shit to catch up on River. Like, just hands like 10-9 off and stuff like that. It's the one card we didn't want to see. Sweet. I'm going to check that. I still think there's actually merit to betting this for value as well with the not king. Ah, oh, we chop against king us, don't we? Take that. <laughs> we should have doubled there. That should have been all in pre. Fucking hell. Give me the stain tag, boys. Give me the fucking stain tag. Is that it? Is that it, boys? Oh, yeah, baby. G fucking G's. Right, so we have made day three of the Venom. We have made day three of a $2,650 buy-in. It's pissed me off because he's cost me fucking 12 big blinds. And he's cost himself $9,000. What do you mean? Right, chaps. Day three is over. Day three is not over. Day two is over. We've made day three. 43 people remaining. We have locked up a staggering $34,000, including bounties. And we're about 40 people away from nearly a million dollars, which is insane. Absolutely insane. Guys, I'll see you tomorrow for day three of the Venom. Do it. Good evening. Good evening, boys and girls. Today is Venom day three. We have made day three of the Venom, which is a great sentence to say. So, here we go. We are 31st of 43 remaining. We've locked up over $33,000, including 25k in bounties. Plays down to the final eight, if I'm not mistaken, today. Yeah, see what we can do. Thank you, everyone, for all the support. It is amazing. Happy with the run regardless of what happens. No complaints. Ran really good up until this point. Let's see if we can make a final table there for the boys. Oh, dear. Picking up the jacks. Okay. He'll definitely have some 7x, I would imagine. Some like 7-6, seven, 7-5 seven, suited. Still think C-bet in this hand is good. Taking it down. 
Okay. Nice easy one with Jax. And we cover top ABZ now as well. And he's got a $10,000 bounty. As many as $10,000. We're going to flat here. Um, and then if he squeezes, we're going to be continuing one way or another. If he shoves and he folds, we're all in. How disappointing. Check round, see a king on the turn. So we turn top pair. Uh, doing a lot of checking. So they can both still have like two pairs. King eight, stuff like that. King deuce. And obviously a loser he has advantage in king X. Calls which is interesting and seven of diamonds on the river. I expect the button to check back a lot. But I think that Big Blind can lead here and have some strong hands. Everything gets there. So I'm hoping this checks through. We can have the best hand against button if he bats, but I can't call, especially with a player left to act. I don't really know what he's got here. It doesn't make sense to have value, but the guy's such a stain that, like, is he ever going to bluff here? No, of course he's not. Wow. That's actually good, though, for us, because now he's shorter. Obviously, we lost the pot, though. Obviously, a fucking diamond on the river as well. Speaking of threes, we are going to open and we'll have to call if top ABZ shoves. As many as $10,000 bounty. Not an unreasonable flop. Really awkward one. I don't want to get check raised here. I don't know if I want to check back though. I do want to pot control. So, really good turn. Yeah, something like this, I think. I think I should value that. I'm going to fucking bottle it. Oh, come on, man. That's such a fucking nasty river. Come on, what the fuck? Lose to nothing as well. I should even value better, so I should lose more, but... Come on, what the fuck? Just a four. So dumb. Okay, they can both have some 9x. And we are live against 9x. Very live against 9x. Do we want to check again? Is there much merit? I guess so, because, like, Crush is going to bet his ace axe a lot on turn anyway. And then we potentially get hands like Queen Jack to catch up and stuff. I uh, can't really raise here, just going to call. Take it, maybe missed out on value, but we take uh, we take winning that pot. He's 10. Yeah, I guess I call and then call a shove from top ABZ. So he's going to open loads. I could shove, actually, but I think call might work better. And if he sho if it goes shove fold, then we call. It was call, call. And we get a top pair. Uh, I'm just going to fold. He should have loads of bluffs, but the guy's such a fucking stain that I'm just going to fold. If he has a bluff, congratulations. Like, I'm just folding there. I will have... I have all my traps as well. So I have aces, queens, ace, queen, nines, because I'm not really playing a raising range there. So I have, like, a load of strong hands. So if he if he bluffed for the first time in his fucking career, congratulations. All right, I'm going to break. He doesn't have that many obvious bluffs either, besides just complete nonsense that might even barrel the turn on a board that's really good for him. So, like, Queen Axe just isn't going to bluff. Yeah. Opening the Queen Jack. We don't cover top ABZ anymore. Uh, he will have some three bats and some flats here. Guess he could have some three bat shoves as well. Uh, obviously, a raise fold this hand. Yeah. And now it's just danger zone territory. We need to basically just three bat shove. He will have a reasonable amount of bluffs, but I can't do anything with Queen Jack off suit there. Well, if there's ever a hand to ask for when you're getting short, this is going to be one of them. As many as queens. Yeah. Big back call at this SPR. Just. Nasty flop against big blinds because he can just have me like close to dead. Yeah, it's just shoving this, I think, versus uh, if no one three bets. I don't think I can cold four bet shove, even if a loser is three bets, but you should be three bet and wide. Can have some traps, but I still think this is good enough to shove here. Yeah. So, we're going to be all in. I'm not going to watch the run out if, uh, if we get called here. Send me your energy, boys.
GG's. Nice run. 10,300 plus 25k in bounties. GG. Just can't get anything going, man. All right. A decent run. Uh, we'll find someone to raid. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>